the next one. And all the way in. Okay, so those are some of the basic exercises that you can do with the men's arm springs. A lot of times when I'm teaching a client, especially a new client, I don't do the whole thing. I'll just pick just a couple of things here and there, and I'll see what they need when they're doing the systems work, when they're on the reformer or maybe on the mat, and I see, okay, so there's a little weakness somewhere. Then I can address it here and really break down their movements and show them how to move properly. Okay, now, the next thing, try to make it, this is a, kind of a complex that I like to do. Uh, it's a little bit more athletic. Um, what we're gonna do, we have a sequence of four movements. We're gonna break down each movement, three reps. And then after we go through all, th all four of them three times, then we do the full complex with flow three times. But again, you have a level of fatigue that's set in by that time. So you have to make sure you're able to control your movements and keep your spine from collapsing. First thing I look at, the main thing I look at is the spine. Everything else to me is just gravy. That has to be under control when you do your movement. If that's not connected, if that's collapsed, that's not stable, then you're wasting your time. And now you're doing more of the traditional exercises where I used to feel the congestion in the joints. Okay, so the first one here, chest expansion. Okay, so again, I just wanna find it, grow, and keep growing. So it's easy for me when I go against the springs to get the spine long. 